So I'm sure that some of you guys are wondering what it's like to travel with a puppy or a dog through the airport. So I'm gonna show you a little bit. We picked up Selby. This is our new um, paper Fairies puppy. She's from Hilltop Farms in Tennessee. And I just picked her up and we are headed from uh, Birmingham, Alabama to Albuquerque. And um, we have to stop in Chicago. So it's like two hours here. And I think two hours again in Chicago and then home. So let me show you what the specifications are for traveling with Southwest in particular. I was really happy to see that all the airports that we traveled through had pet relief areas. They're really neat. They have little grass pads and hoses so you can wash off if your dog urinates places. It was actually really clean in all of the airports we went to. But I'm showing you this video so that we can talk about what the travel crate looks like for um, your dog or your cat. And Southwest actually has one online that you can purchase or you can go to Amazon and pick up one. This is the one that we got. It's a medium size. And our great Pyrenees puppy barely fit inside there. I probably could have got the large and it would have been better but I just wanted to make sure that we did fit in the seat. And because this is my first time traveling with a dog, I really wanted to make sure that I did everything right and wasn't worried about having to ship her ground because I couldn't get on the flight with her. So she's having fun chilling on the artificial grass. There's a little fence, there's a fire hydrant in there, fresh puppy water. It was really clean. I was so impressed. It did not smell at all. People are so good at cleaning up after their pets and they really make sure that they wash everything down afterwards. So I felt, felt, felt pretty safe about having her in there as a little puppy. So let's take a look now at what it was like to go through the TSA. Pets don't go with your stuff through the belt. They actually go through with you through the old school machines. She's looking a little sleepy here because I gave her some Benadryl as a sedative to help her make it through the flight. So we have made up seated on the plane and I want to show you where she is, so check this out. Terminal electric. <laughs> Chef already did, and he has my suitcase and precious cargo. It's 10 o'clock at night. Traveling with a puppy is not that bad at all. She cried a couple times, but I think we give her a little bit of Benadryl, and I think that helps a lot. I'm happy to be home. It was a long trip. Glad to have this guy. <laughs> there you go. Had to travel with the dog to the airport. There's baby. Where is she? Find her. Get it, Gunner. Gunner, come here. Gunner, come here. Where's your baby? Yeah, no. They still can't see her. No, oh, they're good girl, Runa. Who's that? Who's that, baby? Gunner, get up that. Good girl, Runa. There's a baby. Good babies. Okay, out. Get back. Good job. Good puppy! Yeah! You want to come out and say hello? Did you meet them? Is her tired? Yeah? Come on, Jitters. I will speak at you. 